Hello guys, welcome back to Pentestress Club. Today we are going to solve another CTF challenge name called Sinex. So, what is the basic penetration testing methodologies we used here? So, the basic penetration testing methodologies we used here network scanning, enumeration, exploiting the local file inclusion, privilege escalation, and read the root flag. So, basically, we have a two root flags here. So, we need to hunt the two flags and we need to get the root relay access of this machine. So, first, open the terminal. So, you just type sudo su and enter the password. So, you just type net discord minus i is 0. So, we got it, our hosting machine is here. So, you just quit now, you just type nmap minus t4 minus a is an aggressive scan and enter your targeted IP address. So now let's wait for the nmap result. So we got the nmap result that is one with the uh, AT. So we, it's in Apache server. So first we would like to look this one. So come back here, enter your targeted IP address 182.168.0.112. Sorry. This one, one, two, okay. So I would like to change the proxy settings. So come back here. So we get access of this one. So we would like to look here, look the page source first. So in the page source, we not get any useful information. So first we would like to look with the directory buster. Just copy, come back here. File new tab. So we would like to look with the directory buster. So, but we not get any useful information. So, I would like to go with the uh, GoBuster. Yes. And enter your password. So, if you not yet install the GoBuster, so you would like to install in this way. So, we would like to copy this one back here so you just type clear so you just type go buster directory and minus u defines the url and paste this url then specify the word list so i would like to specify the dictionary.txt so uh, when you go with the rocky.txt that will take a lengthy of time so i already got this one is lava land so we would like to copy this one come back here now paste it So we can see here it's like uh, lava land. So ready to join in the cyber phoenix. So 24 into 7 access and version control, no latency, high resolution, modern and fast loading. So we would like to do a penetration testing on this system. So it's like about and home. So now we would like to start the burp suit here. So we would like to do something realistic so you just close this come back here so you just type burp suit so we would like to launch now burp suit now let's wait for this so before that you would like to set up your uh, foxy proxies and everything here
So, uh, before going to here, so I would like to fill uh, in the contact us space. So, I just click on this section in the contact. So, I would like to enter a random like uh, something names. So, I just enter. So, don't consider this one is a totally a fake. So, don't message all those things. So, I'm not going to respond to anybody. So, you just type subject is like and you just type subscribe okay so now let's see this one still it's incoming then you just open new tab then go to a network settings just type here click on manual proxy configuration then click on ok now we would like to yeah now we have successfully got it here then click on proxy then come back here so you can set up the verb suit here now you just go to your proxy you just type intercept resolve now we would like to send a message so we got a message here. Now we can see your post. Lava lamp. Can you bypass me.php? So we got it here. Something useful information. So we would like to copy this one for our reference and we would like to go and look what is there inside. So we would like to come back here. So we would like to disable this one. Now network proxy. So we would like to use the system proxy. So some systems does not work in this uh, type. So now we would like to we would like to look in the new page 192.168. So here also. So we would like to have this. So now we can see here, this is like, I don't know who is this guy. So he just stopped in the bullets. So we would like to look the page source. So we can see here, uh, specify a number. We can see here in the form, uh, specify a number. Input uh, type, text, name file is a placeholder. It's given an integer. So in integer, we would like to remove this opacity 0 is to 0 and we can replace 0 is to 1. Then we would like to look. Okay, now come back here. So we would like to inspect the elements. So we would like to change the opacity 0, 0, 2. We would like to look something useful. Then come back here. This and this here we have the opacity so this was displaying the opacities here so we would like to copy this one we would like to remove so you just remove very carefully here so you just specify in opacity to 0 to 1 so that's enough so not 0 to 1 it's like before it's like uh, we would like to look 0 is to 1 so we would like to write Z uh, 0 is to 0 so we would like to replace this one into 0 is to 1 that's it so then if we enter so we got it as specify a number so now come back here so you don't need to interrupt anything else here so we would like to go to again settings click on the settings then you just set up a manual proxy configuration that's it then you can switch to any verb suit then come back here 
now we would like to again you just type intercept is on so now come back uh, here so enter integer integer is like 0 to 9 any type of number integer you can enter so you just type so I would like to go with the starting with the number 1 then we would like to go to with the number 1 so we have successfully got it here in the integer so we got it here a uh, bypass successfully so now we would like to send this one to a repeater so in the repeater tab now come back here so we would like to enter the local file inclusion here so we would like to try now two three so we would like to type etc password then you just click on send so we have successfully got here the etc and password so you can see here it have in linux uh, lxd and the username is a fault so we can see here so now we would like to come back here in the delete all etc password then you just type home fault then you just type uh, dot sh and id underscore rsa then click on send so we have successfully got the rsa key okay so now we would like to copy now we would like to uh, come back here in the mouse pad you just type uh, nano id underscore rsa so now we would like to paste entire of this one so and you just type save now you just give a permission chm over 600 id underscore rsa now we just type again sh id underscore rsa so we would like to enter so before that i would like to not add get the uh, root uh, I mean another port here so I just mention a port so uh, it will give the port around so you need to wait another one minute here So we would like to I just enter the fault so you just type one one two so port is like double six double eight or something else so we would like to look so it's taking a bit lengthy time so now we would like to look So it's take a bit lengthy time so we almost all get it done so port is you can see here double six double eight so we have successfully entered here double six double eight so you just type yes so we have successfully logged into the port so now you just type id we are in the lxd so now you just type uh, list minus l so here have user.txt so you just type cat user.txt so we read the user tag 
so now it is in lx3 so now we just uh, go to a cd temp directory so now you just type file new tab you just type list so you just type go to an lx3 alpine window cd lx3 alpine builder so you just type i config so this is your uh, targeted ip address so you just copy this one so you just type list so i would like to get this alpine builder okay to in the temp directory so now you just type python minus m http dot server so now come back here so you just type wz get http 182.168.0.118 and 8.0.0 and paste uh, so i would like to paste this one lx3 alpine builder so just copy this one come back and paste it so we have successfully get this alpine builder so now next what we would like to do here is So you just type lxc image import then enter the targeted one then you just type alias my image so we have successfully created here my image so you just type lxc image list so we got our lxc image list so now we would like to just copy and paste this one so we would like to copy lxc image list now come back here So you just copy this one so we have added successfully so you just need to just copy and paste it without a mistake then you would like to look So you just type id, you got it. So you just type cd, mount, root, root, list minus a. So we have successfully got the root flag. So you just type cat root.txt. So this is our lxt. So we have successfully completed this job. So you tried your own guys. Thank you guys for watching. Keep smiling.